isn't for the Miami Dolphins. I'm going to say yes way on this. So let me pop up the way. This is going to be a way. This is, this is off the cuff because I'm, I'm trying to pull up Miami Dolphins schedule here, but ESPN is broken. That's why I go to manhourradio.com and go to their schedule break breakdown because, you know, we got it right there live, raw, and uncut. Uh, but... As it pulls up here, let me find it. Bada bing, bada boom, doom, doom, doom. There it is. So the Miami Dolphins, if I'm not mistaken, have a fairly tough schedule, right? Um, let's see the, who the, who they op, open up uh, up up with here. They're open up with the Patriots, Ravens, Buffalo Bills, Seahawks, and then Jets. So first four weeks of the season could de- definitely very well be losses in the season. Now, now. With that being said, Patriots always play bad in Miami. Baltimore Ravens, we don't know what Ravens team is going to show will show up. And then the Buffalo Bills are going to be good. The Bengals are probably going to be prime good team, but that is at home on primetime TV, right? Thursday night game. Then we have the Jets, Vikings, Steelers, Lions. So, bye week is week 11. Let's say Tua starts the season 0-4. Let's just throw out a number there. Let's say he starts 0-4, okay? Then, at that point in time, I think you got to bring Teddy Bridgewater in. So, that is why I'm saying, wait, by week five, Teddy Bridgewater will will probably be playing for the Miami Dolphins as a starting quarterback for at least a couple weeks. 2-0-4 with, like, with all that fire, with, like, with all that firepower, something's got to give, right? So, then we have bye week at week 11, So that is one, two, three, four, five, six games with Teddy Bridgewater at the helm. Let's say Teddy Bridgewater goes on a losing streak in that two and four, one and five type of situation, anything underneath 500. We have a name out there, Skylar Thompson. He has been performing in preseason. I told you guys from the get-go, Skylar Thompson is the next Tom Brady. Tyler Thompson is a damn good quarterback. If he gets a chance, he will lead the Miami Dolphins to the promised land. Week 11, bye week. If Teddy Bridgewater goes underneath 500 in those six-game stretch and Tua starts 0-4, we will ski see Tyler Thompson by week 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 12. So, yes way on your answer, there, or on your question there, Joey. Yes way, we will see Teddy Bridgewater at the helm this year for the Miami Dolphins, whether it be... Sooner than later, no later than week 12, we will see Teddy Bridgewater if Tua is a non-winning quarterback, meaning, you know, he is obviously a losing quarterback, obviously, because non